Sawadika Vincent. Sawadika. To me. Where are we going now? New with hotel. our backpacks. New hotel. Woohoo! Pool. We are going to an hotel with a pool. Because the weather is so nice. So here's the room. A little bit old style, but it's cozy anyway. The, the key is like huge. They are scared that we lose it maybe. Still a new TV, wardrobe. Big bathroom. Fridge we have. So probably we are gonna buy a couple of beers tonight and chill by the pool with some beers. It's very quiet for being in the middle of the city. I like those lights. <laughs> and we are paying, I think, 220 per night. Yeah, so 11 euros each per night. And we are very close to the bus station where from tomorrow we are going to take the bus to go to Changdao. So, shall we hit the pool? Yes. Let's do it. Yes. Yeah. kind of a taxi truck thing. Uh, we arrived to this temple. How is it called? Exactly, that one. The famous temple. So it's placed on top of one of the tallest mountains in uh, Thailand. And apparently from up there you have a very nice view over Chiang Mai and all the region around. Uh, there are 309 steps to do it. And uh, one of the reasons why it's famous is because they said that if you have a wish and you bring it to the Buddha here and it gets realized, then you bring like flower, like a tanks to the Buddha. So it's supposed to be full of flowers. We will see. Let's start the heart. <laughs>
school. You saw like a temple. Yeah, <laughs> big surprise. No, it's really nice. The only thing I think there are a bit too many people. And you know, I don't know, it lives, it's not that peaceful as you would expect a temple being on top of a mountain to be. Uh, but it's very nice, the inside, like when you enter inside the temple, I think it's very beautiful with the contrast of the sky, you can really feel that you are on top of a mountain. The view of the city is the nicest thing though. Yeah, that's super nice as well. So I mean, it's worth to do it, but if for some reason we wouldn't have managed, it's not that it would have been like, oh my god, we missed it. And... So Vincent, what's the matter of, with this elephant? This elephant? Yeah, come here more it close. It represents basically the, the main character of the history of this temple, because the old king, he received a uh, bone from uh, Lord Buddha. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, that uh, relic, basically, that he wanted to, to bury, uh, make a holy place. He tried to f uh, find the perfect spot for this temple he wanted to, to build. Mm -hmm. uh, but couldn't find any good location. So he uh, let destiny decide by getting on a elephant an elephant and uh, tying the buddha bone to its back and yeah then, uh, the elephant this set off. Mm -hmm. and then he found this place at the top of the hill yeah where he like turned three times three times and then he knew that this is the right spot so then he buried this this bone from buddha and uh, built a temple here that's why this temple is here then on top of this mountain yes. He's hungry, maybe. what they were selling on the stands for how many people they were and you could barely walk like super slowly so we are leaving trying to find a nice place where to relax in peace my sticky rice 